The pursuit of happiness is universal. It's a fundamental human desire. In recent decades, there's a growing global interest in measuring and understanding happiness. This led to the creation of the World Happiness Report, which ranks countries based on their happiness levels. The report provides valuable insights into the factors that contribute to happiness and well-being. It highlights the importance of social support, income, health, freedom, trust and generosity. By understanding these factors, we can create societies that prioritize well-being and happiness. The World Happiness Report serves as a compass, guiding individuals, communities and nations towards a better understanding of happiness. It encourages policies and initiatives that foster happiness and well-being ultimately contributing to a more fulfilling and harmonious world. The Global Happiness Index considers various factors to assess a nation's happiness. Each factor contributes to the overall well-being of its citizens. These factors include GDP per capita, social support, healthy life expectancy, freedom to make life choices, generosity, and perceptions of corruption. Each element plays a crucial role in shaping individual and societal happiness. By analyzing these factors, we can gain a deeper understanding of why certain countries rank higher in happiness than others. This knowledge helps policymakers and individuals prioritize actions that promote well-being. While money can't buy happiness, it does play a role. Higher GDP per capita often translates to better living standards, health care and education. For example, countries like Finland and Denmark, with high GDP per capita, consistently rank high in happiness. They offer robust social safety nets and quality public services, contributing to their citizens' well-being. However, happiness isn't solely determined by wealth. Many countries with lower GDP, like Costa Rica, also score high in happiness due to strong social connections and a sense of community. Strong social support systems are crucial for happiness. Knowing you have friends, family and community to rely on during tough times provides a sense of security and belonging. Scandinavian countries, renowned for their comprehensive social safety nets, demonstrate the importance of social support. These nations provide their citizens with access to health care, education and unemployment benefits, fostering a sense of security and well-being. Conversely, countries with weaker social support systems often see lower happiness scores. The lack of a safety net can lead to increased stress and anxiety, impacting overall happiness. For Section 5, Health and Happiness the well-being equation. Good health, as it turns out, is a cornerstone of happiness. Healthy individuals are more likely to be active, engaged, and experience a higher quality of life. Countries with high life expectancies like Japan and Switzerland often rank high in happiness. Their focus on preventative health care and healthy lifestyles significantly contributes to their citizens' overall well-being. However, Health extends beyond just physical well-being. Mental health is equally important, and countries with robust mental health services often see higher levels of happiness. Section 6. Freedom to choose, a pathway to happiness. The freedom to make life choices is paramount for happiness. Feeling in control of your life from career to lifestyle, fosters a sense of autonomy and self-determination. Countries that uphold individual freedoms, such as Canada and the Netherlands, consistently rank high in happiness. Their citizens enjoy the freedom to express themselves, pursue their passions, and make choices that align with their values. Restricting personal freedoms can lead to dissatisfaction and unhappiness. When individuals feel their choices are limited, their sense of autonomy and well-being diminishes. 
Section 7. Trust, the bedrock of a happy society. Trust is a vital ingredient for a happy society. Trust in government, institutions, and fellow citizens creates a sense of security and cooperation. Scandinavian countries, known for their high levels of social trust, consistently rank among the happiest nations. Their transparent and accountable governments foster trust, leading to a more cohesive and happy society. Conversely, societies with low levels of trust often experience higher levels of crime and social unrest. This lack of trust can erode social cohesion and negatively impact overall happiness. Section 8, Global Happiness Rankings, a snapshot. The World Happiness Report offers a glimpse into the happiness levels of various nations. Finland consistently ranks as one of the happiest countries. Thanks to its strong social support systems, high levels of trust and individual freedoms. Other high-ranking countries include Denmark, Iceland, Switzerland and the Netherlands, all sharing similar characteristics that contribute to well-being. On the other end of the spectrum, countries facing conflict, poverty and political instability often rank lower in happiness. These nations face significant challenges in providing their citizens with the basic necessities for a happy life. Section 9. The Happiness Index, a lens, not the whole picture. The Global Happiness Index provides valuable insights into global happiness trends. However, it's important to remember that it's just one perspective. Happiness is subjective and influenced by individual experiences and cultural contexts. The index provides a broad overview, but doesn't capture the full complexity of happiness in every nation. Despite its limitations, the Global Happiness Index serves as a valuable tool for understanding the factors that influence well-being. It encourages dialogue and action towards creating societies that prioritize happiness and fulfillment for all.